Lesson thirty six. Smoke. Do you smoke? No, I don't smoke. Which person in your family smokes the most? My brother is the person in my family who smokes the most. How many cigarettes does he smoke a day? He smokes twenty cigarettes a day. Wait. If you arrive too early at the station, what must you do? If I arrive too early at the station, I must wait for the train. Do you like waiting? No, I don't like waiting, but I hate waiting. If you arrive here at the school ten minutes too early, how long must you wait for the lesson to begin? If I arrive here at the school ten minutes too early, I must wait ten minutes for the lesson to begin. Is it pleasant to wait for somebody in the rain? No, it isn't pleasant to wait for somebody in the rain, but it's unpleasant. Ever, never. The word ever is positive and is generally used in interrogative sentences, whilst the word never is negative. What's the difference between the words ever and never? The difference between the words ever and never is that the word ever is positive, and is generally used in interrogative sentences, whilst the word never is negative. Does it ever snow in the south of Italy in summer? No, it never snows in the south of Italy in summer. Do you ever come here on Sunday? No, I never come here on Sunday. Does the sun ever shine during the night? No, the sun never shines during the night. Is Christmas ever on the twenty-first of December? No, Christmas is never on the twenty-first of December, but it's always on the twenty-fifth of December. Square, circle. What's this? It's a square. What's this? It's a circle. Square. Round. Is the face of my watch square? No, the face of your watch isn't square, but it's round. How many pictures are there round these walls? There are two pictures round these walls. Does she walk round the classroom during the lesson? No, she doesn't walk round the classroom during the lesson, but she sits on her chair. Business, nature. Price, bush, foreign, shake. What am I doing? You're shaking your pen in your hands. Do you always shake hands with your friends every time you see them? No, I don't always shake hands with my friends every time I see them. Direct, directly, method. It is called think. This method we are using for learning English is called the direct method. By this method, the student thinks and speaks directly in the new language without first translating. What do we call this method we are using for learning English? We call this method we are using for learning English the direct method. By this method, does the pupil translate before speaking? No. By this method, the pupil doesn't translate before speaking, but he thinks and speaks directly in the new language. More or less, is it more or less time to go to bed, to have lunch, etc.? Yes, it's more or less time to go to bed. Are the countries of Europe more or less friends today? Yes, the countries of Europe are more or less friends today. Accent. What kind of accent do you speak English with? I speak English with an Italian accent. Where's the accent in the word beautiful? The accent in the word beautiful is on the first syllable.